are you storing your artwork in a way that will prevent it from getting damaged? Hi, I'm Lisa, the artist behind Law Cree Fine Art. Today I'm going to be sharing a few ways that I protect my own artwork. One of the worst feelings in the world as an artist is to have a painting that you spent weeks or months on and to have it get scraped or a hole put in it or ripped, torn, wrinkled, anything like that. I think I've had all of those things happen at one point or another. First, for my oil and acrylic paintings. I get really large bolts of felt from Hobby Lobby, which is pretty inexpensive, and I basically make a big pillowcase, which is custom for whichever size canvas I need to store. All I do with these is cut out a long strip of fabric for whichever size canvas I am working on. I then fold the fabric in half, and then sew two edges so that I have one single opening. I like the felt because it has a little bit of padding, and I've never had a painting scratched that I store it in here. You just need to make sure that your paintings are completely 100% dry before you put them in one of these sleeves. And they just slide right in. The next step for storing these canvases is to either store them in a large box or on a shelving system. I have these wooden shelves that I got from Ikea that are about, I think it was under $30 for the large set here. I then use pieces of foam board in between each set of paintings so that one painting isn't pushing on another, stretching it out badly. Foam core you can cut down to whichever size that you need if you are storing it in a box, but that has worked really well for protecting my paintings. Next, for my drawings or anything that is done on paper, I get these portfolios. You can get them at any art store or Amazon. This one here is pretty large. It costs $33 and then I had a 40% coupon at Hobby Lobby, so saved some money there. The important thing with this, you don't just want to use a regular binder that you would use for schoolwork. This is acid-free and archival, so your artwork is not going to be damaged. The other thing is the outside is really thick plastic. That is also going to help protect your work. With these, you have little slots and you just slide your artwork in there and it's all nice and safe, and it holds a lot of work. If I have a drawing or a painting that I've already framed, but I need to store that or I'm transporting it to an art show or gallery or something like that, I also put those in these sleeves here to protect the frame from getting damaged. Way too many times I've gotten to an art show and had to sit there with a marker and do touch-ups because something got shipped in the car. These are really helpful for protecting frames as well. Thanks for watching. If you're new to my channel, I have new video critiques every Tuesday where I'm critiquing your original paintings or drawings, my own speed paintings, drawings, and tutorials every Wednesday, social media tips for artists each Thursday and artist vlogs every weekend. So if you haven't already, I would love for you to subscribe. You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr, Google+, Plus. all of those social media sites. Links are below in the video description to keep up with news, my newest work, and see real-time clips of whatever it is I'm currently working on. I'll see you guys this weekend.